Hey, we're in the booster program here, phase two. Uh, we're on booster day A, uh, strength day, uh, strength part of the, of the workout. So we're going to pair the first two exercises up or lower. We've got our first step of pairs is squats, bar squats. Um, this is what you guys should be doing. This is going to be one of your best exercises to change your whole entire body. Uh, we want to set this about chest height. And as we get in here, we want to practice not on our neck, but on our shoulders. And I'm going to come in here, practice crossing the shoulders, keep my elbows tight to my side. Walk back. Now I'm putting a bench behind me because a lot of people don't go deep enough or don't use their hips. So this kind of automatically gets me to use my hips. So I'm going to shoot my, my butt back, knees out, come down, tap my target. And I'm going to look up as I come up. I don't want to crank my head back. My eyes are down, forwards, I come down, pushing up to the heels. And as I come down, I want to push my knees out. That keeps me stable off the bottom. And this might actually be a little high for me. We want to try to get the parallel. When you come in, make sure you walk it down. Knees in the rack. Don't fall back into the rack. It's number one. So squats, use a weight. One thing too is use a weight you can get some depth with and you can get down there. If you're doing sissy squats, going halfway down, screaming and wrapping your knees, don't even talk to me. Um, <laughs> make sure you do these right. That the depth is good, the form is good, the weight will come. So number two is going to be just our dumbbell bench press. Um, you're going to take one of the half challenges can be getting these up. What I like to do is just swing them back and then swing and fall back. Use my hips. My whole body, once I'm up here, is start with them together. We're coming wide. I'm pitching my shoulder blades. I keep my feet glued into the ground. I'm squeezing my butt and my shoulder blades together at the bottom, and I'm driving to the midline. So coming down, pinch the shoulder blades, butt's tight, feet are on the ground nice and solid, drive into the middle. You want to drive to the middle because we're targeting the pec muscles here. It's the primary mover. When we go to the inside, we're doing what's called adduction, which really kind of fires up the pecs. So that's your first two pair of exercises. We're working a six to 10 progressive load, three by six, week one, three by eight, week two, three by 10, week three. And then week four, we're gonna turn and we're gonna go into another, we're gonna move the weight up and try to get six to eight reps at the new higher weight.